I'm here this morning at Virgin Atlantic's clubhouse at Heathrow Airport, speaking with Richard Branson on the launch of his new route to Accra in Ghana. So Richard, if I could ask you a few questions. You're launching a new route to Accra in Ghana this morning. You've had some difficulties operating in Africa with Virgin Nigeria, so why come back to it? No, look, uh, uh, Ghana is um, uh, a wonderful, democratically electric country. Um, uh, it's, it, it's expanding extremely well, just discovered oil. Uh, it, uh, it needs a competitor, the, the local airline's just gone bankrupt. Um, and so we think it's an auspicious time to start. And we also happen to be starting on a, on a, on a day which British Airways have gone on strike once again. So and anyway, positive, a, positive, a positive news story for a change. During that answer, you mentioned uh, British Airways and their problems at the moment. You've been very vocal about the tie-up between British Airways and American Airlines. Um, leaving that issue aside for the moment, uh, is there any chance of Virgin coming together in some form of alliance or joint venture? Well, look, if we fail to stop British Airways and American Airlines effectively merging, um, we may have to think about uh, doing something similar ourselves. Um, it's not something we wish to do. Um, you know, we, we believe that. American Airlines, British Airways, Virgin Atlantic should compete in the interest, interest of the traveling public. Uh, we'd love to stay independent, um, but, um, you know, but we may have to consider our position if, if uh, the authorities allow BA and American Airlines to get together. So if Virgin was to get into bed with somebody, who would that be? There aren't many other airlines that we'd like to get into bed with, so it's going to be um, quite, quite difficult to actually contemplate it. Um, and I hope we won't have to contemplate it. I hope that the competition authorities will realize that uh, allowing BA and American Airlines to get together will be to allow an unholy alliance to get together, not in the interest of the traveling public. Um, I suspect if they allow it to happen, we'll go through the courts to try to stop it because um, you know, we, we, we believe that uh, the competition authorities haven't taken everything into consideration that they should have done. Uh, and only then will we start thinking about the Virgin Atlantic's future and whether there are other people we should work with. So you've launched the new Accra route today. Um, where is going to be next on your wish list of destinations? I think that there are a number of other long haul routes we'd love to uh, go to. Uh, Chicago, Toronto, Vancouver. Um, you know, we have a sort of priority list of, of, of places. Um, uh, love an inaugural, so um, you know, hopefully we'll, we'll get on to the next one soon.